Okay, in this video I want to show you briefly how to uh, adjust the opacity and what that does in your layers palette. I've pulled my layers palette out from down below up into here. So I'm selecting the top layer which happens to be the picture of this dog and there's a little opacity option right here that I can click on and basically a slider. I can also just type in a number but I'm gonna go ahead and drop that slider down to 50 percent and you'll notice that now I can see through the dog to the background layer. This opacity is just basically how see-through uh, a layer is, or rather um, how, because it comes from the word opaque. If something is opaque, that means we can see it. It's not see-through at all. So if something is 50% opaque, then that means half of it, or or it's 50% see-through, uh, meaning it's sort of, we can see half of it and it's also allowing us to see through. If we drop that down to 25%, you'll notice it gets even easier to see the background and the dog sort of becomes just, uh, just faded out. Almost we can't see it at all. We go down to 10, we can keep going, but that is what opacity does. It allows us to basically see through a portion of an image. So sometimes that can be helpful when you're trying to blend images together or it might be helpful. This also works on text um, or anything you draw or create, shapes, that sort of thing you can also use opacity for, which can be helpful when creating sometimes.